when i think about this wind instrument the chromatic harmonica in my mind there are three different instruments i know that's weird three different instruments there's the instrument where i play it up here in this part of it and the part here in the center those holes and the ones down here and all three sections are played with a different technique to get the optimal sound from the instrument and that's what we do with music is we we hunt we're on the hunt for beautiful sound so let's talk about the differences um, the methodology to play down here <laughs> bass. Chin forward, open up, tongue low, oh, 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 and the larynx glottis up. That gives a huge resonance chamber here. And don't forget the hand on the right means a lot. Watch. It's only 3%, but it, it's something more. Don't forget, a runner wins the race with a small amount of additional speed. Same with music, it's little changes. So we come out of here. The instrument's easy to play here. Relaxed embouchure, just keep the hand here. That's about the shaping of the mic, okay, to the, the harmonica. And this, this shape is a sound chamber too, isn't it? So if you wanted, you could bring it down. which is different from tighter. It's like we're expanding and contracting the inside of a piano to give it more room to play. So, but it's hard to do that. I tend to keep it about here. Now, when you get to the top, to these guys, I'm shooting straight air quick. So I just kind of contract my mouth a little bit so that I'm really shooting the air tight. We lost some of it. You lose more with the right hand on the high end, I think. I mean, in other words, this has more importance here than it did down here, because it's down here, you can get it really even without it, but not up here. Anyhow, recap, there's three instruments on the one, as I think about it, and the technique used in play. Uh, I hope you enjoyed that one. It's kind of a different way to think about things.